As tensions escalate across the Taiwan Strait, Taiwan is developing remotely operated underwater vehicles, or ROV, to defend its waters. The government has launched a domestic program to build ROVs, aiming to respond to the growing threat from the People's Republic of China PRC. Just like aerial drones have changed modern warfare, unmanned underwater vehicles offer Taiwan new ways to defend its maritime territory. When discussing with the military, they hope the vehicle can operate at higher speeds, allowing it to cover larger search areas more efficiently. In shallow waters where visibility is often poor, sonar becomes critical for both navigation and mine detection. The military also emphasizes the need to lower production costs. The current version is designed to clear sea mines. Future versions are expected to handle counter-attack missions. Much of the system is built in Taiwan, but key components like sonar systems still rely on imports from Europe and the U.S. Some technology are still under development to close remaining gaps. Before Taiwan fully develops autonomous underwater systems, wired ROVs provide an immediate mine clearing capability. If local companies can master full integration, from simulation to sonar and optical systems, it would strengthen Taiwan's security. Taiwan not only controls critical sea lands into the South China Sea, but also sits at a vital strategic point connecting U.S. allies across the Asia-Pacific. At the same time, China has been expanding its navy and coast guard presence in these waters, sending clear messages that military actions remain on the table. Developing unmanned underwater vehicles allows Taiwan to adapt to new forms of maritime threat to strengthen its defense and security. Ye Yufu, Chen Ruhuan, Simon Lu, TVBS World Taiwan.